My name is Dr. Will Kirby and I'm a cosmetic dermatologist in Beverly Hills. I have a lot of celebrity patients. I have huge contacts in Hollywood. It's an exciting time for me. How are you, beautiful? Good to see nice you. Nice to see you. What's happening? Not much. How have you been since I saw you last? Good. One of the things that I do a lot of is tattoo removal, and I consider myself an artist. Um, we're going to leave a little bit of this ink here, which we're going to get at a later date with the laser. Okay. Tell me what's going on. How can I help you today? I want to get rid of the tattoo on my lower back. OK, that's a very common place to see it. The tramp stamp area. Is that what people are calling it these yes. days? Yes. <laughs> I've heard of that. I'll tell you what, let me take a look if I could, please. Why don't you stand totally. up for me? So all things considered, this is a very treatable tattoo. Awesome. May I touch it really quickly? Totally. Is that OK? Totally. Okay. Tamika has what many unaffectionately refer to as a tramp stamp. It's a tattoo that these attractive young women have on their lower back, and it's probably the most common tattoo I see. I pride myself on painless injections, so you are barely going to feel this, OK? Yay. You feeling that at all? Not, not bad. Great. Yeah, it's fine. Not bad? or No, no, it's, it's, it's famous. It's awesome, right? It's famous. That's what I like to hear. Yeah. I woke up and uh, noticed, uh, how do I say this? A bump on my hog. OK. Uh, if you will. Not the medical term, but nonetheless, <laughs> I understand. My best friend Mike is coming to see me today. He called me about a day ago, real worried about something. He didn't want to give details, but um, you know, I have my suspicions. For me, it's Dr. 90210. Please welcome Dr. Will Kirby. <laughs> What would you say your specialty, though, is? I do a lot of tattoo removal. Lots and lots of tattoo Oh, you removal. do a lot of celebrities, right? Right. Like you've done Vanessa Marceau, I know. Mm -hmm. And who else? Um, Kat Von D is a patient of ours. Why would she get any removed? I thought she, she just adds on. That's the thing. She wants to add. You run out of skin eventually. And she's so beautiful in person, I can't even tell she you. She is. I've had her on the show. She's very sweet, too. Dr. Will Kirby is here, board-certified dermatologist, representing Neutrogena. First of all, I think the reason it's so popular is because the retinol in here is stabilized, and that puts it in its most efficacious form. And retinol has been around for about 10 years, and people really widely recognize it, particularly in the dermatology community, mm -hmm. as an anti-aging ingredient. The process is actually relatively complex, but we keep it simple. It's an ND YAG quality switch laser. We're going to fragment the ink and let Josh's body absorb it on its own. So on three, I'm going to get started. You ready? Absolutely. One, two, three. There you go. Beautiful. It's actually not bad. Black is the is the um, ideal color to treat, and Josh is really pale, so he's a great candidate. You can clearly see the great result he's getting yep. here. Well, the main reason is you can get a secondary infection. I see it probably about once a month. I have someone who comes in, they had a skin tag, they picked it off, they cut it off with nail clippers, and they get an infection. It's really simple though. I'm just going to clean it with a little bit of alcohol here. Little tiny pinch here, Vito. On three. One, two, three. Little tiny stick. That's all you're going to feel. Are you doing okay with that? Yeah. And I'm just checking a little bit of lidocaine with epinephrine just to make sure he's nice and numbed up. It's exceedingly common, and we see it all the time. And like you guys alluded to, it's not only athlete's foot, but it's jock itch, same entity, and we need to treat both areas. But you want to make sure it's not something else, too, because there can be um, other serious diseases. Most likely, though, sounds like jock itch.